As one Dmitry Medvedev prepares to assume Russia's presidency, his 26-year-old namesake has a big day too. No. Getting married, like winning office, can be a step into the unknown. But this newlywed Medvedev, a computer programmer in a resurgent Russia, has confidence in the future of the country the other is set to leave. I think that now in Russia we have professionals in power. Putin, now Medvedev. I trust them. The main thing is that we have stability. That's really important. But how stable will this marriage of Russian power prove to be? Once he's sworn in, President Dmitry Medvedev will be the main source of authority. But the popular outgoing leader, Vladimir Putin, will stand over his shoulder as prime minister. It's potentially destabilizing in a country where power is rarely shared. At this point in time, you only have one political institution that can be housed in a man's jacket. Well, there'll be two jackets uh, from uh, May 7 in Russia. Uh, but, but they will not be equal, they will be a hierarchy. And few doubt that hierarchy will cause friction, even if Medvedev and Putin stay close allies. The days of Russia with only one centre of power, one Tsar, may be coming to an end. But that doesn't mean we should expect a big shift in Russian policy. On key issues like dealings with the West, democracy and managing Russia's vast energy wealth, there may be differences in tone. But Medvedev and Putin, so politically close, may prove essentially the same. Disappointing for some, but just fine for many more, including the other Dmitry Medvedev. Continuity is what he's been promised. And as this new Medvedev era begins, it's what he wants too. Matthew Chance, CNN Moscow.